Hey guys, welcome back to Rib Ribs Adventures, and today we're going to explore the Osborne Big Bug Search. Pretty excited. Some of the bugs we're going to be looking at are right here. So let's get started. Raise your hand if you like bugs. Alright, the Big Bug Search. Wow, look at this. She's kind of explaining the book right here. Got young bugs, hidden extras. Look, there's even gonna be animals in this book. Wow, ew, that's an ugly spider. Whoa, so bugs that you can find in homes and gardens. You got snails, fleas, garden spider, house flies, moths, caterpillars. Ew, a cockroach, that's gross. Look at that, that's called an earwig. I think I've seen those in our house before. I didn't know they were called an earwig. Look, did you know flies could be green? Look at those green flies. Wow. Ew, that one's called a devil's coach horse arch. Hmm, weird. Wasp, I've seen those before. Wow. Zebra spiders, I've seen those before. They actually kind of seem friendly. Wow, look, a honeybee, and then look, butterflies. All right, these are bugs that you would see in Cactus City. Wow, look at that. Mexican red kneed bird eating spider. It eats birds. Painted grasshopper. Hmm, harvester ants. Hercules beetle. Look at the size of that thing. Look at that, a whip scorpion. Ant lion larvae. Ooh, link spider. Yucca moth. Nothing. Look, a tarantula. Wow, I've actually held a tarantula before. Look at that, a southern black widow spider. <gasps> and then you have blister beetles, honey ants. Giant red velvet mites, Ugh. scorpions, more spiders, and then tarantula hawk wasp, what? These are some pretty big bugs that you're going to find in Cactus City. What's cool about this book is the bugs that they tell you, you actually have to find them in the pictures. So River and I love to look at this book. This page is called Island Paradise. These are some bugs that you might find in the islands. Look at that, a weevil. <laughs> That's a funny name for a bug. Look, empire dra dragonfly. Dragonflies are cool. Look at that, look at that guy. He looks weird. What? That looks like a crab. Is it a crab? No, it's called a thorn spider. Wow, more cockroaches, icky. Wow, longhorn beetles, it's cool, it's yellow and black. Aw, rosé bugs. Kind of pretty, but not really. Green lynx. Man, that looks like trouble right there. Look at that thing. Did you know that's a bug? It looks like leaves. Wow. Let's go on to the next page, see what we can find. Whoa, look, we have to turn the book this way for this. Dazzling display. That's what this page is called. Look at all these bugs. Some of the most beautiful insects in the world live in rainforests, but they are often hard to spot. And look, this page is really cool because you have to find all of these bugs in this picture right here. There's 95 bugs total. Wow, look at that. Assassin bugs? Wait, you're saying that the name of this bug is Assassin? That's pretty hardcore. Aw, but look at this butterfly. He's blue. Mm -hmm. Wow, another Hercules beetle. We saw that before. A leaf cutter ant. He eats fungus. Ew, gross. I'll take one fungus, please. Ugh. Look at this grasshopper. Did you know it's a grasshopper? That doesn't look like any grasshopper I've ever seen. Whoa. Look at that beetle. That thing looks nasty. Whoa, look at that butterfly. Look at all the different colors. Wow, a thorn bug? <gasps> Look at that spider. It says a wandering spider's bite is so poisonous it can kill a person. <gasps> That's hardcore. Well, let's turn the page. 
Oh, and look, we have to turn it back this way now. Wow, between the trees, all kinds of amazing bugs live in the thick eucalyptus forests of Eastern Australia. Wow, so these are some bugs that you can find in Eastern Australia. Whoa, like a fierce Sydney funnel web spider. Wow, that's a caterpillar right there. It looks like some fuzz. Wow, look, a red-backed spider. It almost kind of looks like a black widow, but it's not. Sawfly larvae. Ugh, those are gross. Another moth. That's actually not a butterfly. That's a moth. And look over here. Cool. Look, emperor gum moth caterpillars. Look, water world page. Ponds are perfect homes for many small creatures. That's true. So these are some bugs that you might find in a pond. Do you guys have ponds near where you live? I know we do. Back swimmers swim upside down. Funny. Mosquitoes. Oh, I hate mosquitoes. They always itch when they bite. Water striders skim lightly across the surface of a pond. Have you guys seen those before? I know I have. It's like they can walk on water. Great diving beetle. They like to swim, huh? I think all these bugs like to swim. Look, a water stick insect. He kind of looks like that stick bug from the movie Bugs Life by Disney, doesn't he? Whoa, look at that thing. He looks like he has seashells all over him. Oh, that it is. A catus fly larvae are safe inside a case covered with pebbles and shells. That's cool. It's like they decorate themselves with pebbles and seashells. Oh, look at that thing. Whoa, diving beetle larvae. Scary. In the woods. These are bugs that you might find in the woods. Look, a cute little snail. Whoa, a wood ant. Ants bite. Whoa, look at that guy. He looks like he's about to fight. Cool. Longhorn beetles. Ooh, a hornet. Buzz. Look at this guy, he's a slug. Ooh, slimy slug. Ooh, a crab spider, look at that guy. He looks intense. He looks kind of grumpy. What is this one? Swamp life, whoa, these are bugs that you can find in the swamp, like in Louisiana. Look at this crab. I like crab, yummy, yummy. Whoa, look. Jumping spiders. He can jump really far. And look at this guy. What's that on his back? Whoa. Look, a zebra butterfly. Cool. I wonder if he's related to a zebra. Aw, look at this butterfly. So pretty. This book is really big, if you can tell. Deep in the jungle, the jungles of Southeast Asia are always busy by night as they are by day. Wow. Look at that. Look at that red centipede. That's gross. I don't like bugs. Look, longicorn beetle. It looks like he has big eyelashes. Hmm. Wow, this is cool. Nephilia or Nephila spiders can spin webs out of pale yellow silk. Hmm. Wow. Well, look at that guy right there. Lantern bugs got their name because they often float around people's lanterns. Oh, cool. What's this page? Mini bee safari. People go on expeditions or safaris to see the wildlife of Africa. So these are some bugs you can see in Africa. Hmm, let's go and find out. Longhorn beetle, African assassin bugs. Whoa. African land snails are the largest snail in the world. I didn't know that. Wow. This is pretty cool, y'all. Whoa, look. Here's some different pages right here. Insect City. It's gonna go over termites, other different bugs. That's pretty cool. Tells you how they live. This page right here is Busy Beehive. It kind of goes into the intricacies and lives of bees. Tells you how they're made, how they make honey. And look, this book has even more, Around the World. It tells you where you can find different bugs around the world. And then look at this. Big Bug Puzzle. This book is so cool. Look, it even has questions about the bugs that you've just learned. Whoa, and then you have a glossary back here. So this book is really cool. We got it off of Amazon, and it's called The Osborne, The Big Bug Search. Try and say that 15 times as loud as you can. 
Well, thank you guys so much for joining us at River Ribs Adventures. We post new videos all the time. Please subscribe. We'll see you next time.